They're in the gate. And they're off. And it's 7th Street who breaks well. And uh, Color Me Up is hustled out of there as they move for the first turn. Weathered's on the outside. Misses out, or rather, 7th Street goes very wide into the first turn, leaving a big opening at the rail for Color Me Up. Then on the outside, it is Weathered who runs along in third. Sprightly's back and forth in the early stages here. Then Miss Ezella and Luna Vega. Into the backstretch run. There'll be no free ride on the lead for 7th Street. Color Me Up's right there with her on the inside of her. 23 and 2 was the opening quarter mile. They straighten away for the run down the backstretch. Head to head are Color Me Up and 7th Street. Just to the outside, weathered up close. And now there's room at the inside for uh, Sprightly. Sprightly now trying to get through down toward the rail. Right there in between horses, Missy Zella's only three lengths from the tooling leaders, and another three back to Luna Vega with four and a half furlongs to go. The half was a strong, contested 47 and one fifth seconds. Color Me Up has a narrow lead over 7th Street. Just in behind them, it's sprightly down toward the inside, weathered on the outside. Missy Zella's right up there in between those two. And Luna Vega's getting underway now. Luna Vega's launching a wide bit as they come to the top of the stretch. Three quarters and one. Eleven and one. And the field turning for home and the go for one. Seventh Street well off the rail. Room at the inside for Sprightly. Sprightly comes through an opening on the rail. Now Sprightly's in front. Seventh Street is fighting her. Missy Zella, Luna Vega on the far outside. And it is Sprightly, the leader. Seventh Street fighting hard all the way. Missy Zella third. Sprightly narrowly. Seventh Street fights on to the lead. It's Seventh Street in front coming down to the wire. Seventh Street is the winner by a length and a quarter. It was a photo for second between the oncoming Miss Isella and Sprightly.